just kind of continuing on from the last vlog uh, where I mentioned that Battle Lamp for Murder and Prometheus were both going to be released in 3D. And I had mentioned that I was heading to Walmart to pick them up. <laughs> and, well, of course Walmart has the 3D version of Prometheus, high profile movie like that. But they did not have Dial M for Murder. Fortunately, we have this music video game store uh, called Hastings around here. Um, I walked in the first five minutes of, uh, of them opening and I went right to the video guy as I saw him, uh, the video associate, <laughs> as I just saw him uh, putting up the movies and I asked him if he had Dial M for Murder in 3D there. And he said, yes, he did. He picked it out and he says, this is the only one we got. So I took it. Let's talk about that first. The, uh, I still have to go through some of uh, Prometheus's uh, deleted scenes. Uh, and I'm kind of mad about the Blu-ray because of that. Because a lot of the deleted scenes I would have rather seen in the movie than how the movie actually turned out. I still love the movie though, but... Uh, that's just kind of going along with, you know, it's got some great deleted scenes in it. But, Dowling for Murder is the one I want to uh, speak about today. Now, this is a, a 1954 uh, Hitchcock film. And Hitchcock, uh, Alfred Hitchcock wasn't that proud of this film. It's, it's something I felt like Warner Brothers had forced them to do. He was only given one stereoscopic camera and uh, and that's kind of uh it's kind of the charm of the movie though and i'll explain that here in just a moment but the movie uh stars uh ray milan and uh grace kelly you know uh and i was trying to put together i was watching this movie in 3d uh the picture is great by the way there was only one brief scene in it which seemed kind of flat um, and it lasted about a minute or so but uh, you know the rest of the 3d and the actual blu-ray picture looks great in this film in fact it looks so great it does make you feel like you're there in this small little tiny set that the, they filmed this movie in the reason why i'm mentioning this is that uh you get to see ray milan uh, get associated with you know his performance in the movie, and I was just like, wow, this guy seems really familiar to me. Why does he seem so familiar? And then I got thinking, and he did like this uh, character tick that he does with a lot of his characters, and uh, I figured it out right then and there. It was from uh, the original Battle Star Trek back in 1978, even the premiere episode, where he played Sire Yuri, this gluttonous, selfish slob that, uh, that is on like the rising star that's keeping all the, all of his food, hawking all of his food from the starving people in the fleet. And I, I watch him in this performance and he's much younger here. And which really messes with my mind because I remember how long ago Galactica was and this movie is 24 years older than Galactica <laughs> and so here I feel like I'm sitting in the same room as Ray Milan when he was a much younger man and, and it does it, it brings a serious mind mind mess you know so I really enjoyed watching this movie because the way it's filmed you know Hitchcock might not have been too proud of it, but then again, it, it makes you feel like you could do the same thing. And, uh, and, and it gives you kind of connection with it. I'm not saying I'm going to start putting up murder mystery, 3D murder mysteries on my channel. I'm not saying that. But, uh, but I really appreciate it because you feel like you're in uh, this, uh, this play. So to speak. It, it feels more like a play than a movie, and uh, it feels like you're right involved in it. It's very cool, very cool stuff. So yeah, I I really love Dial for Murder, and uh, definitely one of the uh, great movies of my collection. 
Uh, next week, I uh, also have Preacher from the Black Lagoon come in, and that one's in black and white, so I don't know how I'm going to feel about that, but, uh, but I think it'll be great. I hope everybody has a good day, and uh, I'll talk with you later. More stuff on the way.